Hi and welcome back to another episode of As Dusk Falls. So last time I was a little surprised about a couple of things with this game. First, it was the the art style was really pretty, but also very distracting to me in the beginning. But then as we went along during like the second half of the last episode, I kind of got used to it and um and I was able to visualize their expressions without actually seeing some of their expressions during the scene. So I think that's very good. The other thing was I was very surprised at how quickly we got into action-ish scenes and how much I felt very torn on a lot of the decisions. I thought that was quite nice to be very unsure of what I wanted to do. Enter or left mouse button to start. Yes, we're starting any second now. So I really enjoyed that I struggled and that the decision seemed quite impactful though they might not be but they felt quite impactful you know detroit become human takes about two three hours to really get into it but this one took only one episode now i'm really curious to see where the game goes from here i'm wondering i do think we're probably gonna see more of these characters because you know there was a gun scene at the end where it looked like he pulled the trigger i don't know what that means but also do we get more characters now you know is the next section gonna have more characters or not i don't know but i'm really excited to play today so now let's get into it press a enter or left mouse button to we are start. starting relax all right let's go yes we're still okay we're still here I'm just watching out for the volume here oh it was empty i told you i wasn't gonna hurt anyone did you, you are really Dale, get the duffel bag. We're out of here. Okay, I'm gonna try the volume there and see. Oh my god. I thought I'd lost you. Me too. Oh. My legs are shaking. Vince, you can't try to fight these people. I know why you did it, but you just can't. Um, yeah, it was stupid. Uh, I agree. It was stupid. <laughs> I don't know what I'm thinking. Know. It just really kept died, pushing me, and then I just so did it. Watching. You were stupid. No, it was brave. Just yeah. Well, don't get I'm trying cold. not to. I really Daddy, am. Did they hurt you? Oh, sweetie, I'm fine. <sighs> Two days from now, we'll be in St. Louis, and it'll be like none of this ever happened. <gasps> yeah. Well, we did alert the cops. So what's gonna happen now? Guys. Not going anywhere. Fuck! Now you're gonna have a hostage situation on your hands, or you gotta Dante. leave. He'll get us out of here. You got more faith in him than I do. do we control a cop now? Is that Dante? This is Sheriff Romero of the Two Rock County Sheriff's Department. Yeah, what are you going to do about you this? You know that already. The good news is, in Arizona, burglary is a class three felony. You can practically get off with a warning. The bad news is, you did some... Oh, it was the house we broke into. <laughs> my wife home. Yeah. Jay, check they can't get in the back. Uh... You people are smart, you'll save me some trouble and just give yourselves Yeah, up. why don't they? How do they think they can get away? We're not talking with this asshole. Right? Dante will get us out. He's too strong-minded for his own good half the time. But he gets things done. Not if I'm the one who's gonna control him. You know him well, what's his deal? Will they negotiate? Uh, will they negotiate? So will they even negotiate with him? I mean, if they rob uh -huh. their own sheriff, that can't be a good omen. Not sure Dante even knows it's them. Once he finds out, mm. he might not want to negotiate either. Wonder if he knows Ash isn't here tonight. Ash is your son? Yeah. Best thing I ever did. We're sitting ducks here. I say we stick to the plan. Take our chances with a hostage. The back gate's chained up. There's no way in. Tyler. Yes, you should. 
Maybe we should just give ourselves... Smart Don't kid. Don't say it. Romero's impatient, and these small-town cops couldn't catch a cold. Our best move is to wait. Wait for what? You think things will get better? I don't get it. Is someone gonna get that? The police are gonna catch you and put you in jail. You cut it out or I'll put you in a corner. Uh, hey! You can't talk to my granddaughter like that. She's six years old. She's just speaking her mind. Yeah, I'm speaking my mind. Enough! Next person who talks is going in the back office. There's a second phone back there. If you could reach Dante without them knowing. Oh, he's gonna talk. Um, I'm not gonna insult. No, I'm gonna crack a joke. I'm gonna crack a joke. Hey guys, what do bank robbers eat for dessert? Uh, heist cream. I don't yeah, get it. You're an idiot. You know that? Is there a cream that's I mean, called ice cream? It was kind of funny. Wow. He gets it. You just don't have a sense of humor. All right, that's it. Into the back. No. Don't separate us. He'll stay quiet. Michelle, it's fine. It's not fine. None of this is fine. I think you both need a little time out. Jay, make sure nobody answers the damn phone. Uh, Jay isn't, I don't know, I, I, he's a little kid. Keep your mouth shut, and don't make me come in here again. I wouldn't split people up and lock them up. You, there's so many ways to get out of things. What if there's like a scissor in a drawer? Calls again. Good thinking. Can you get your hands free? You should be able to lean against it's each other and get up, right. maybe. How do we do this? Friction, maybe. Or we use scissors. Yeah, the scissors are right there. Or we use scissors. Like why? Hmm. Think you can knock that pen holder to the I floor? mean, these these kids aren't really that smart, so I shouldn't really ask why, because it seems very obvious to me. Don't make too much That's noise, it. though. It's gonna fall. Try to cover the noise. By coughing? I'll cough. On three. One. Two. Mm. If it's the cops, they're gonna keep calling. Yeah, they need a the plan. Scissors. Uh. They need a plan for this. The kids. Uh. Quick! I'll Achieve it. What's your emergency? I'm in the Desert Dream Motel. Can you connect me directly to the sheriff? This is Sheriff Romero. Who am I talking to? Outcome. My name is Vincent Walker. Mm. And I'm... My family. We're hostages in here. Whoa, slow down there, Vince. Now, I can help you. But you gotta relax. I mean, I felt that first, that was pretty right? calm of him. I don't have much time. Uh, my dad is so scared. The motels, their last name is Holt. Let's tell him about who they are. So the maybe he know this, what he's dealing there's with. There's three of them. The manager said they're the, um, the Holt boys. Oh, no shit. <laughs> well, that explains a few yeah. things. Yeah? Yeah? Like what? It's a long story. But tonight's gonna be the end Oh of god, it. I don't like that. Well, You're good. Keep going. Kyle is in charge, Dale's a psycho, one's just a teenager. Let's say one's just a teenager. I care about that kid. Jay? The youngest brother, the one they call Jay. He's just a kid. I don't even think he wants to be mm -hmm. here. Probably bullied into In case anybody gets shot, then... It's good to identify a weak link for us. Oh, for okay. You. We're gonna try to use him? Hey! They blocked oh. the door! Shit! Vince, this door won't hold. Can we not say anything? Motel stuff is safe, I guess. Joyce and Paul are both doing okay. Yeah, Joyce is tough. Always told her she could have been. We're having this calm wanted. conversation while they're trying to break into How the door. He's at a friend's house, I think. Oh, that's good. I'm almost out of time. We are out of time. Put an end to this thing. 
feel like they would want more answers, but we can't talk longer. Next time you talk to one of my hostages behind my back, I take him to the window and shoot him. Mm. Keep your people 30 yards from the motel and don't call us again. How are you gonna get out of this? What did you tell him? Uh, everything. Yeah, everything. I've been lying in the past, it didn't go so well. I told them what's happening yeah. here. I told them shit. That the Holtz were behind it. Fuck! These cops. They might work for the county, but they are loyal to him. And he does not care about any of us. And you do? Yeah. Huh? What? Leaving you two alone together was a dumb idea. It was. That hurts. You should never have come to Two Rock. Yeah, you still haven't, like, done any real bad things yet. And the moment you do, you're going to be in more trouble. So I don't feel like you won't do that. I don't see how you're getting out of this. So, let's see. Twelve years as a flight mm. mechanic. Pretty high up. We're going to then, the past. Day, bam. Bits oh, you're a flight mechanic. That makes sense with the um, hospitalized with the thing they talked about in the car world. last time. All because you left a lug nut loose. On a DC-10. No, that wasn't me. It was a faulty compressor disc. Mm. The airline was cutting corners. I kept warning them, but... It's still your word against theirs. My advice, sign the Makes form. sense. It's hard going up Take against a big company when you're the only it's one, maybe, who awful. knows the... It's a gag order. Answer. If I sign that, it's professional suicide. Mm. Look, They're gonna keep you from I working ever again, check. huh? It won't even cover my rent for a year. All I want is my job back. Mr. Walker, I've... with all due respect, you never work for me. I feel like you have to try to to now, fight for to what's thing, right. Pick up the even if it's costly, even if you maybe won't win. Uh I don't wanna flip the desk, but I'm not gonna sign it. You could stick your gag order and your pen. Right up your ass! Yeah, I, I... Oh, so you do got a little fight left in you, huh? Yeah, I wouldn't have, uh... If you don't fight for what's the truth, then who who else is gonna Shit. do it? Even if it's tough. Two days before. <clears throat> Hello? Sorry. I'm probably busy packing. I just picked Zoe up from swimming. Look, if we'll you know you're soon. right... Everything okay? Even oh, if the uh, others win? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. At least you tried. the strangest dream. I was back in the lawyer's office. A dream? At this time of day? While I was packing, you know, like... Not everybody can afford what would our, our happen life. through that, though. Missouri. As long as everything's boxed up and in good shape for the landlord. I know this move is a big step and tons of stress, but I've got a really good vibe about it. You got a good we'll vibe, huh? I'm just gonna pick up Chinese. <sighs> Zoe! Sorry, gotta go. Sure, okay, but... I can't believe I fell asleep. We're gonna. All right, big man. You got until seven to get this apartment ship shape and ready to go. Where do you want to start? Um, I don't know. The dishes. Where's the dishes? Sure. Uh. Mash. I got it. Another circle. Swipe. I can swipe. All right, dish is done. Um, go outside. Pack boxes. Maybe we can fix this. Seems like something we should fix. Okay. This is anything like the cold air unit on a flight deck. Ooh, four there buttons. Be... Well, this is obviously alien technology. Swipe. Up. Tap. Cool. I do mash when it says tap every time. That control. It's a Just in case. By Vince. Yeah, we're good. We're good. The What's boxes next? are the, another thing. Pack photos. Check weather. Pack boxes. I feel like make the cert. I feel like I want to pack the photos and then pack the boxes if I have time. 
just pack them. Yeah. Seems like I'm packing my whole world away. We're out of time. We don't have time to look at them. And now, pack boxes. And then if we've had time for anything else, then I'll figure it out. What we do then. I guess some dreams never get off the ground. Mm. I don't want him to lose his job. I want him to keep working with what he likes working with. Daddy! Hey! Hi, Pumpkin. How was your last day? Okay, I guess. Millie gave me her address, but I'm gonna miss her. Mm. No, I hear you. It's a big change for everyone. Yep. We'll write to her as soon as we get to St. Louis. Okay, gotta help Mommy now. Why don't you run upstairs and get your PJs on? Are you going to put me to bed tonight? Sure thank you. Aww, <laughs> she's the sweetest thing. I know you worked hard today, so I got you your favorite. Ooh, yes please. Mmm, shrimp. Could have said thank you. By the way, did the moving company call? Um, nope. I mean, I was asleep, so I don't know. Awesome. You took care of yeah. everything. Yeah! Heck yeah, I'm a good dad. Uh, honest? Yeah, let's not joke about it. Yeah, the couch tried to stop me with a five o'clock nap, but I got it done. Another bad night's sleep. Uh. Are you feeling any better? I feel like that was sort no, of a I'm joke fine. still. <laughs> Just that dream I had about the... You know what, never mind. You remember what you told me when I got laid off from the tax office? Make sure you empty the stationary cupboard on your way out? <laughs> no. You told me that change only hurts when you try to stop it happening. And you were right. If I hadn't gotten laid off, I would never have mm. finished my PhD application or gotten Sometimes my job bad at the things university. I get it. Turn into good things. Focus on the positives. Later. Down the line. God, I'm starving. It's definitely true. I've already eaten, but I haven't had a chance all day. Nice. I'll get her ready for bed when you get noodled up. Noodle up. <laughs> he loves joking all the time, doesn't he? Sometimes that's um, can be Come seen on. as a very defense mechanism, you know? Like you're hiding hurt, yeah. and instead of so, joking about everything, maybe you, you feeling should about the move tomorrow? try to talk about it more. Looking forward to it. I dreamed that the movers took my... I like having serious conversations. Me. And I was so scared, because I never sleep in the dark. Hey, you know what? I had a bad dream recently. Mm. About something I can't get off my mind, and I wish I could. Was it about the dark? No, but... The dream. The thing about dreams mm. is... Maybe sometimes they're trying to tell us something. Like... I don't know about what? that, but... Uh... It's okay to be scared, yeah. We should face... I like more saying it's okay to be scared. Because a lot of the times in life you are scared about some things, and that's okay. Facing your fears is fine. We all have things that scare us. Like the dark. And that's okay. But if you if you I guess we just learn to face your with fears without day, we won't be looking at so when I why you're scared it, of it. I might not even need Then you might Star ignore Man. the <laughs> thing and then it might cause more trouble in the long run, sort of. It's so hard to express a okay. thought when I'm also trying to Love pay attention the to what to they're the doing. Love you too. That's why I paused so much last time, but uh, I don't know. Uh, I feel like I shouldn't pause so much. Show up tomorrow. How hard is it to send a confirmation message? Settled already. <laughs> well done. I'd better go kiss her goodnight before she drops off. Yeah. Well, there you go. I bet that's them right now. Okay. New message. Gonna miss your sweet little smile, Cupcake. One last drink. Who's Bruce? Nah, I'm gonna trust her. Whoever that is. Though... Him calling her Cupcake? I, I don't like that. But that might be a Bruce thing, not a her thing. 
Why would you keep talking to someone who keeps calling him Cupcake? Unless it's like a internal joke. I need to get the hell out of here. Anyway, we're back in our little room. So let's not... Let's try to not do anything dangerous. Search desk. Try door. Oh, let's just search the desk then. There might have been more stuff, I don't know. Okay, that's the desk. Hairpin, could be useful. Could try to go through the window? The thing is, if we go out there, nothing good will happen. But if we try the window, we're not in the room. You know, if we go out there, they're just gonna put me back in here, won't they? Not getting out that way. Okay. So it's only the door. I guess you want. They want us to try the door. There's hey. no problem with doing that, though. Swipe. I was ready for tap. <laughs> I can't believe that actually. But works. why? If we can sneak and they won't see us, yeah. But if they see us, they're gonna be mad. But they're not gonna start shooting people now. Hey, did you hear something? I'll check the back door. You could try to lock him in there. Zoe's up there. She's scared of the dark. Oh, yeah, we should definitely try to sneak up there. Get to Zoe. They're coming for you. Girl. You know that, right? Shut up, Joyce. I'm serious. <sighs> They're gonna end up hurting her. I just know it. Should we run? Take our chances cross country? Yeah, you should. Just keep quiet. But don't take Jay with you. Also, that guy shouldn't run. Uh, it, it, it's... Makes too much noise, you know? Zoe, it's me, Pumpkin, it's Daddy. Where is she? Oh, did she climb up onto the roof? Don't leave me. Don't make it. <gasps> Jay! Listen. Jay is nice. He wouldn't hurt a kid. Me. It's Vince. I'm coming we in. Don't, we don't we don't hurt the kid Daddy. and the kid the Jay is fine. We like Jay. I didn't hurt her. I I, I trust promise. you. I know. I hurt. Zoe, you okay? Daddy. I, I don't either. I don't either. Hold her tight. Yeah. No need for wise words. Just comfort hey. her. Remember what I told you? It's okay to be scared. Let it all out, Pumpkin. Do you think they're gonna try to come in? Uh... Warn him, yeah. We should warn him. I'm pretty sure... I don't care if he says anything to the other boys, but... I don't wanna go to I jail. I wanna protect the kid. And maybe... You'd better hide. Listen... I'm gonna get us out of here before... Before the lights come back on. Okay? With mommy and grandpa? Of course. We won't leave them behind. No, we won't. I don't know how I'm gonna save them, though. Honestly, I would have left the kid with Jay. I feel like she's safer there. Are we really gonna sneak down here with. Oh my god. She's safer with Jay! Are we really. How are we gonna do this? Are we gonna fight them from inside? Are we gonna sneak out with her or? Why is the door open? Are you guys all right? Oh, I don't like this. Oh, you found her. Can oh everybody God. stay quiet? I think they went out the back. Why did they go out the back? We need to get out of here. Give me your wrist. Did they run? I don't understand. Are you hurt? No. Are you? Oh, they oh, came inside. God. Okay. Hey, down. All right. Don't shoot. We're hostages. 
stay down and don't yeah, I move. Won't. Where are the perps? It seems like they're run away. Finally done the smart thing for once. Oh, they haven't run away. Shit! Uh, uh, run for the door! I'll cover you! Seriously? We're gonna have a shooting? Oh my god, somebody's gonna die. Sanchez! Shooting with hostages in the room? Can can some cop try to get us out of here? Come on, it's now or never. We won't make it. Yeah, we'll get shot. Run for it, stay hidden. Stay hidden. Yeah, no, that door is um. We need I understand, go. but they're shooting wildly I'm here. Dying in this motor. Oh, that's gonna get shot. What the shot. hell are you doing? Grandpa! He's gonna get shot. Or knocked out. Knocked out is fine as long as he doesn't get a brain hemorrhage or whatever. I knew this was a bad idea. Hold fire. Repeat, oh hold my god, fire. this is. I said 30 fucking yards! You try that again! Well, I feel like the other choice somebody would have gotten shot, bag. so. I'll take this. They're still alive. Hurt, but alive. But I don't understand how the cops failed that, honestly. Jim. Jim, can you hear me? Oh, jeez. All right. Okay. Vince? Is Grandpa uh, hurt? I don't know, honey. I mean, he is hurt. He's bleeding. Jim, are you okay? So he's not okay, but... Dad! He needs an ambulance. Get him an ambulance! Yeah, we can... We can... He looks um, all right. Maybe just a concussion. It's not just that. Oh, it's... Tumor. Yeah, right. I knew I had a cancer, but I... the wrong spot or something? Oh, shit. I didn't he's still think about it being a brain tumor. Oh, God. This is. Hey, we all make strange all decisions when we're I panicking, so okay? I bent on making amends. Hey, are you with us? Uh. Know where you are? Yeah, let's ask him if he knows where he is. Jim? Uh, do you know where we are right now? Arizona. Sam Bluff okay. Motel. That's good. Oh, no, it's fuck. <laughs> The <laughs> Maybe I got a concussion What's too. Old name before I uh, bought it. Oh, I'll, he's been I'll here be before. Right. I, I just need a, a minute to, to get Somebody my... should. Yeah, somebody should have helped him though, because he could have just fainted. He needs to see a doctor. Yeah, he does. Can we get an ambulance, guys? Can we like negotiate for something? And Jay was fine because we told him to hide, right? Because the cops came from upstairs. And he's gonna be like, oh, appreciate that. Dale, go see if you can barricade the second floor. Mm. Mm hmm. What? No, no, stop. You listen to me. What I want is a helicopter or I start killing hostages. This seems like uh, Detroit. That's right. The first hey, scene to Mexico. Mexico. where the Since deviant when? one in a Since helicopter. Now. You boys are in way over your heads. You couldn't even nail a burglary. Now you want a helicopter? Spare me the lecture. Can you do it? Ah, get him a freaking helicopter. I'll look into it. First, I need a show of faith. Let one of the hostages go. Now, I ain't much of one for faith. All right. So let's make it practical. You must be hungry for a hot meal. All right. How about we send you food, you release a hostage, and then I start on that helicopter. We can send the, uh, the dad out. Enough or for the that grandpa. I mean. town. Franco's. Said you delight. <laughs> this guy. Oh my minutes. god. <sighs> this guy. Good news, folks. One of you's going home. Fuck. <sighs> what happens if we send the kid instead of the grandpa? That's kind of more important. But keeping the kid there might keep these guys a little bit more in check. And the d grandpa might die. I miss your sweet little smile, yeah. Um. Finally got confirmation from the movers. Tomorrow morning. Good to go. Hmm. At least we get one last California sunset. Uh, yeah, I don't know 
if I want to send the kid. Thirteen years ago, I couldn't wait. The kid to might convince them to stay nice. First person somehow. in the family to go to college. <laughs> My mom. I'll never forget that look of pride as she waved me goodbye. Ooh. But you know what? Ooh. I never realized how proud I'd feel to be going back. I just wish it didn't involve so much stuff. Oh. Yeah, moving is so Is there anything so more tiring. stressful than moving? I don't know if it's stressful. Well, maybe a little bit. Uh, divorce? Six-year-olds are probably more stressful, yeah. Trying to get Zoe to go to well, sleep? Maybe not that. Yeah. Top of the list. <laughs> We're not gonna talk about divorce because we saw one text, anyway, okay? Tonight is our last night. There's gotta be more so than that we... for me to consider mm -hmm. her cheating or something. So, how about we make it one to remember? Kiss her. I'm a huge fan of trusting people. Um, and trusting people to be honest. That might bite me in the butt. But so far, it's gone pretty well, so. I don't know. I like trusting people more than doubting people. It's a happier place to live. Leave it. It'll wake Zoe. Mm, probably will. It's quite loud. Hello? Well, thank you. It's been nice working with you too. Oh, I'm sure you'll all do just fine Let without her me. finish. Good luck to you too. Someone from the university. Hmm. The one you just left an hour ago? What can I say? My colleagues miss me already. Colleagues like Bruce. Why did you... Vince, have you been looking at my phone? Daddy? Hmm. Hmm. Zoe. Hey, you should be in bed. I, I couldn't sleep. Even with my shirt. Oh, I'm yawning so much today. <sighs> Maybe I should go out and take a nap or something. Yes, sweetie. Jeez. It's like we 11 a.m. together, right? You, me, and mommy? Always. Well, I can't promise that. I don't know. Things happen. Why I don't like promising that? things I can't keep. And his parents used to argue. Or don't know if I but can now keep. now they don't get to live together anymore. It's normal to be... Don't worry, honey. Insecure We're not doing and that. arguing a little bit. But. Yeah. Like, there could be a person who wasn't able to say, like, real goodbye at the university, you know? So, to me, it's not that strange that somebody would be like. So, uh. I didn't really. I wasn't able to you. say that I appreciated working with you on stuff. Oh, he's just one of the macroeconomics lecturers. We did some research together on the Ecuador financial crisis. There isn't much else to say. What, what wins should just say right now? I haven't looked at what he wants to say, but what he should say is like, I don't know that he's feeling just like really insecure, and unsure of himself, and and he's thinking these things, but he wouldn't really consider her doing it. But then again, doubting her in the first place just creates a rift, right? But. Then again, you should be able to talk about how you feel unsure. But if the person is actually cheating, that might make them try to hide their evidence more, right? So I don't know. I don't know. But I like being honest. I really do. You never mentioned him? Uh, you never mentioned him. So, I don't know. You never said anything about him before. I have. Mm. Plenty of times, but whenever I try to talk about work, you oh. switch off. I don't switch off. Well, that makes sense then. I just Vince. Don't remember you talking about him. Yeah, because you didn't see a message like that before. Let's forget you don't know who he this. is or how he talks. Don't let it ruin our last night. We've got a long few days ahead of us. I mean, don't let it ruin the night. You can tell he's distressed about it. This is a situation where I that I hate, right? A person is being really unsure and insecure and just like really frazzled about it. And the other person, instead of trying to comfort them or try to acknowledge their feelings, they're just like, hey, let it go. Let's drink some wine. I don't like that. 
And then that makes him cover up his feelings and emotions for the next time you're going to have this kind of conversation. He's going to bottle it up and then it's going to explode. That's what happens to all of us humans when we hold something inside that we're unsure about or we're thinking about or, you know, it never comes anything good out of it. So, like, in tune with him, I think I should refuse the wine because she's playing this like, hey, just let it go. Instead of being like, I, I can tell that you're thinking something here and you shouldn't i love you and i always have and bruce was just the guy i worked with like she should comfort him i don't like it uh i'm gonna refuse it i'm gonna i, I don't know she's not listening no and i feel like also wine would maybe just be a bad idea when you're feeling like bad you know something about it doesn't add up You've been working late. More they than need usual. to talk about because this. I, because I'm changing schools. <laughs> I need to leave on a high note. You know, last week you said that you had to stay in great papers. But you came back smelling of, oh. of wine. If there's more perfume. signs, Look then that's concerning. Thanks. I know things have been hard. This last year wasn't a great one for us. But nothing happened between me and Bruce. Can you please believe me? That's very desperate. No, it's not desperate. It's just, can you please... It's very forceful. I don't know if the game is trying to hint at something with this conversation, or if it's just, like, plain and simple. Just like, hey, can you please believe me? Couldn't she have said it like that? Hey, can you please believe me? But the, can you please believe me? It's like very, mm, I don't like it. What's happening? Oh, this is a crossroad. They're moving to get, I'm just gonna, why does he have to apologize for, uh, we say sorry too much, guys. We say sorry too much. He doesn't need to say sorry for feeling like this. I really want to doubt her now though. You know, if there's... Okay. Like, looking into this conversation, when she's talking about, like, he was just the guy we did educational finance, whatever, with... She didn't really... Like, if she worked with him on something, she should be able to say more about him. And, and also, the, like, I talk about work all the time, and I've mentioned him before. That could just be, like, you know, gaslighting. Saying that because you know uh, our guy is like sometimes doesn't pay attention or gets distracted and then you kind of use that against him because he doesn't remember. But then it also might never have happened. Uh, I'm gonna say I'm sorry. I think I just... I want to trust her. I'm sorry. Maybe I overreacted. He is on edge, sure, just, but I don't know. Like you said, I've lost a lot. If she smells of year. wine and perfume when she gets home from work? I don't want to lose you too. I know. It's a it's little bit right. funky, but okay. Now come here. To me, she she has so far seemed like she really cares about him. And I feel like you would be more distant. And manipulative if it was true there was any truth to it, so I don't know. Are you okay? No, it's fine. I'm just um I'm just tired with the move and everything. Yeah. We better get some sleep. We have a long drive tomorrow. Good night. Night. Something is off here though, between them. Maybe they should have talked about it more. Achievement, keeping the faith. I'm trying, I'm trying. Vince, I'm worried about your dad. Yeah, I'm worried too. Head injuries, bad enough on their own. But if he's got something up there pushing against his brain. How's he doing? In pain. But he wants Zoe to be the one sent out. And Vince, he's right. We've seen. I'm gonna have to choose, aren't I? Have. Please. Just get She's gonna be mad if I send dad. But I want to send dad, kind of. 
Because I don't think they will hurt the kid. Come on, old man. You're going for a walk. Not me. Please. T take Zoe. I'm... Uh... Well, there's nothing wrong with me. I don't care who goes, but only one of them. That's such a tough choice. I don't like it. He's gonna die if we keep him here. She can end up saving us, even though I don't think she should be here at all. Like, the, the right choice here would be to send the girl. Real life situation... I would send the girl, no problem. This is a game, and I want to save everybody. And I think sending dad is the right choice here. Or the grandpa, because I think he could die here if we don't send him. And I don't think Zoe gets killed. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with sending Jim. Jim, you have a head injury. You're getting an MRI. That's the end of it. Please. I don't need a hospital. Take him out, grab the food, come on back. I'm watching you, Vince. When I bump my head, Mommy puts ice on it. Maybe I'll try that. I love you, kiddo. And also, if I was Grandpa, I wouldn't let that happen and I would just die here. You know? I would Hey. make the look, kid go. You dropped this. But I have Jay here. He won't let anything happen to the kid. Her name's Owl. Owl, huh? You know they can see in the dark. <sighs> okay, they're coming out. Stay right where you are. Wait, where's Zeus? Oh yeah, take the dog with you. Where you got hit in the head. Is it on the same side? That's what? That's the tumor. Oh, uh, God. No, that's what he wanted to talk about earlier in the game when I stayed with my wife. He lied to get compassion. Oh, fuck. Grandpa, if you get the kid, if you get the kid killed because I thought you would die here, ha, 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 ha. Oh Vince, God, I would punch him. <laughs> there is no tumor. How hard were you hit? You were diagnosed a year ago. It's in your parietal lobe. Uh, it's not real. He wanted love. It. What? Look. A year or so ago, my closest friend Tony passed, and, and suddenly I was alone. Oh, I get my being friend. lonely and wanting compassion from others. I, I get that point. I don't get lying for, for... Lying to get compassion and love is not the right thing. Just lying in general, I hate it so much. Like, I hate lying with a passion. It's manipulative. And in the end, when the truth comes out, it's gonna end up worse for the whole relationship here. And the dynamics between this family. No, it's terrible. It was a really bad choice. I can, I can forgive people for doing things like this. But it changes everything. It changes... You won't really believe them again or let them in in the same way again. Brother was long gone. I had no Yeah, that doesn't excuse it. Look Just at the situation you. which you're currently in. So I started to imagine being a father again. But you weren't gonna let me back in your life after so many years, not without a good reason. Yeah. No. No, 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 Tell me this is the... Instead of going about it slowly and just trying to be a nice dad, you know, like, hey, could we maybe have a coffee together or just sending flowers or, um, you know, take things a little step at a time 
to try to heal the the wound. They're like, "Hey, I'm Tumor. Can you love me now?" I'm gonna stop talking. Okay. Talking. I'm annoyed. You ask to move in with us, Vince. I don't know why I did it. Oh, you I said why you did it. I guess I've just been lying to people for so long I can't tell the difference anymore. Yeah, if you can't tell the difference anymore, why would I want you in my life? They're giving me an out. Why admit it? They're giving us an out to heal the relationship. Um. Oh man, this is a tough one. Like, he was a shit dad, right? The game... I said I was gonna stop pausing and I keep pausing. He said he was a shit dad for, like, he was gone for 30 years. And suddenly he's like, I have a tumor, which is a lie. And now he's like, I told you the truth right now. Uh, and I don't know why I keep lying, but I can't seem to to stop myself from lying. Why am I gonna keep you here? You lied not too long ago. You say you can't tell a difference anymore. Why would I keep you here if I know you're going to continue lying to me and my family? I, this is just fucked up. And and now he's like, oh, I told you the truth. Can you please forgive me so that I can be a part of your life? It's like, no, you haven't done anything to prove that you actually care about us. You only care about you and your feelings in this matter. You only care about not being lonely. You don't care about being actually a good person to this family. I want to say we're done. I don't want to go as far as like you're a bastard. But in this situation, I feel like that's what you would normally do because you're stressed in a host hostage situation and, and you just should have chosen the daughter to, to get out here. I'm going to say we're done though. We're done. You fuck off. You know what? Save your breath. For any wasted time. I tried caring about you, dude. Change. Please, son. Things just got out of hand. Hey, hurry it up! Things got out of hand. Everything good I've ever had, I've ruined. My marriage, my health. And now he is manipulating you into having empathy towards him. You're like, oh, I can never be a good person. I, I've ruined everything I've been. I'm blah, 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 blah. No, you're say, you should say I'm sorry. You should fucking grovel on the ground and say, I'm a terrible person. You don't deserve this as a family. I understand if you want to cut me off. I totally get it. You should do that if it's for the good of your family. I would hope you could forgive me, but I know that I would have to fight really hard for you to want me in your life anymore and i totally understand that's what he should say instead he's like yeah i fucked everything up i always fuck things up and you're, you're supposed to have empathy towards that no 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 son i lied no because I no a no no that's not an apology i want you I want no i want zoe. i want i want a family i want you i want zoe tonight. i want Please. Give me That's not shot. the way you do it. No. No. You'll never change. Sorry. No. You're done. You think I'm ever going to trust you again? No, I can't do it. I, I'm sorry. This Elijah. is a situation where it's like, no. Take care it's yourself. too late. Tell Zoe. Tell her I'll always be there if she wants me. I should go. Before he recognizes yeah, you have been here before. I knew that. He has um he has a situation with this place from earlier in his life. And I don't know what, but I'm sure from Hi. Errol. And I guess Dante. you must be Vince. Yeah, that's me. Give him the food and send him back in. Yeah, we're going. I know how hard this must be for you, Vince. But I've got good news. Why? Yeah. We're about to have a man on the inside. Jay? Hang in there, buddy. I love him. We're rooting for you. <laughs> that cop is cool. I like pick him. Pick him up and don't do anything stupid. <clears throat> Pizza night. Hey, 
Don't forget the napkins. Two-way pager. I'll be in touch soon. Ooh, you better get Enjoy that out pizzas. of the box before he finds out we have it. Oh, you did get it. Okay. Hey, it's the it's pizza a lot of pizza. Guy. You're late. No <clears> tip. <throat> oh, yeah, that's fine. God, man, that grandpa. Well, what oh. a cop kept oh. his word. Pizza ain't mm. hard. A helicopter, though. Look, I know you didn't want this, but you got Romero wrapped around your finger. <sighs> I really hope you're right. How long? I spent ten years saving up for this place. Ash only just started to feel at home. How can we stay here yeah. now? Yeah. We'll give the walls a fresh coat of Aww. paint. Replace the glass, you'll That's see. Sweet. It'll be good as new. It's not the walls. It's what happened within them. Yeah, this is enough to give you PTSD, right? Towards this place, wake up with nightmares, cold sweats, that kind of thing. It might never be the same again. Grandpa it depends on how you deal with trauma and traumatic and stuff, right? right? Strange thing, though. I think he knows the sheriff. Really? I don't know. Seems like he was a bad guy in the past. He didn't say. But I met him and he was... Uh... What? Um... Wait. Are we talking about Dante? He's up to something. He'll keep us safe. I don't know. I want to trust. I don't know. I'm not knowing what what's happening. Seems like he's got a handle on things. I think. I should There's hope something so. else here. Because the alternative. You want my take? Steer clear. Now, don't share this, but Dante's a mm. cousin of mine, and him being sheriff, ain't no one in the family. Oh thought that God. Was a idea. Oh God, this is bad. Then. What are you doing? I'm gonna fill it with leftovers. Jay, you gonna eat? <sighs> Not hungry. I want it to be over, Tyler. I'm gonna. All of it. I'm worried. It'll be over when we this win. game actually, this you game is that? dragging me into the story. I don't even care that not like super big decisions food. happen. Well, some of them do still, but I am. I don't know. They're putting doubt in my mind and I don't like it. I'm saying nothing big happens, but everything feels kind of big, honestly. I, I'm, I've never met a game that puts me under so many life choices where everything just feels very overwhelming to me, where I can't really decide on what I actually think is a good idea to do because... On one hand, I have my moral compass, compass, co compass, compass, and on the other, I have what I think the game wants me to do and how I think we should maneuver through this game, and they're kind of conflicting on a lot of this. Here, I would love to say just yes, but the guy in this shop seems really nice, and if he's, he's saying that we shouldn't trust him, then I'm like, but also saying maybe or hell no on this thing seems very dangerous towards you know the cop wasn't his name called dante why is it saying vince i'm confused no way did it say vince can i trust you our guy is vince god i'm gonna say yes we can always change our mind later you want to share that with the rest of us? They took from me a black book. Um, um Nope. Don't think I do. Um Are you serious? Just search deaf? their stuff? Hmm? No, you can't have it. I I don't think I should do that. <laughs> huh. They took a black book. That probably has some incriminating stuff towards Dante, right? 
Dante is probably a piece of shit. And Tyler, who's the ringleader here, right? Maybe he isn't a bad guy. The other guy, though, he's a piece of shit. Like, peeing in the bottle in the fridge and stuff, and, you know, very unstable guy. Tyler might actually have a good cause to be doing this towards Dante, right? And the black book might hold something really dangerous. Oh, wow. This can... This just got even more interesting. Huh. Hmm. Wants me to do, like, a secret mission? What do you mean? I would like to try him? to make friends with them There's to try to understand pieces. their motive here. For us. So back the fuck off. You asshole. Paul has low blood sugar. It's fine. I'll eat from the vending machine. We don't get to eat? Mm. No. Yeah, that guy I is unstable. No. Really unstable. No. <laughs> uh we're gonna Hmm. Let's try to be on their good side, sure. Hey, how about we just do what we're told? I don't... Huh? What the hell, man? We're all hungry. Yeah. They need their strength. We can eat when we're free. When did you start giving two shits about us? When I'm trying to get on your good side? Ooh, oh, oh, hmm. I, God, I need to stop pausing, but like, reason, joke, and charm all sounds fine to me. I think he jokes too much, though. <clears throat> but he liked my jokes. Yeah. See? What I'm thinking is, reason, I don't know what that means. But I like reason. I like being reasonable towards things and thinking about things clearly. That's how my brain works. Joking was good for this guy because he liked jokes. Charm is, like, very interesting. And, like, maybe it's good to be charm charming since we're trying to get on their good side. See? How am I supposed to choose in one Fucking millisecond. Uh, I mean, I do get like 10 seconds, but I'm gonna try jokes with him. No, no, no. He liked it last time, so. A hungry kidnapper is a grumpy kidnapper, uh, right? <laughs> yes, he likes it. Oh, that's it. true, I guess. <laughs> they giving you problems? Oh my god, yeah, that's funny. I got this. Uh. Oh, shit. Sorry. Oh no, now we want the snoop. <laughs> Clean it up. I want to know what the book is, but I don't... You know what the trouble with you is? You get too fucking involved. If you what just stay quiet does to Tyler with, want? Be gone by now. <laughs> Never thought of it like that. What you don't get is... Ah, uh, we're doing it, I guess. You needed money, but it's not like... Tyler. I can't mess shit. up now. No Jay's into nature. Me? Yeah, I robbed the liquor store once, but... I'm getting the job soon. There's this girl I got it's my not here. Though, why Jessica would date me after this shit, I got no idea. You probably took uh, the, the book on it. Tell a joke, tease him, feign interest, offer sympathy. Let's feign interest. This girl, Jessica. Oh, no, that's bad. That's no. Me? No. I don't yeah, want to that, that right? was a bad sentence. She's none of your goddamn over. business or anybody else's. In fact... Don't ever say her name I... again. Hey, I was just trying to... You know, you know get you on my what? good side. Yeah. Be mm -hmm. my friend. Go fuck yourself, Yeah, th this, this isn't Whatever. the guy we should talk Enjoy to. It's Tyler. I don't think pizza's happening, guys. Oh, I wasn't Oh, God, he's anyway. gonna show up later, huh? Blood sugar things. We're gonna get caught eventually, too. You got my helicopter? Yeah, I got it. The FAA's cleared you to cross between Mexico and El Paso. I think they wouldn't do that, though. Now, uh, before I authorize the landing, I want to have a talk about why you picked my house. Face to face, out front, where there's no deal. Mm. What's he playing at? Some kind of trap? Maybe. But right now, we need to play his game. How about I go? 
I got some things I nah, can say. I don't no think way. that's good. I told Ma I'd look after you. It's all right. I put my big boy pants on today. You mess with us? It's the I mean, if they take Tyler out, then all hell breaks loose. You'll be fine. You have my <clears> word. <throat> so. Pizza boy. You and I are going for a stroll. Hey, tell Dante he better get us out of here. Hmm. Have to hold me so tight. It's not my fault your neck's so fat. I'm coming out. God damn. I can't wait to be on a beach somewhere. Eating tamales, drinking tequila. I'll get there, sure. You're almost there. Just keep a cool head. Mm -hmm. Cool head, right. Mm -hmm. Sound like Tyler. Come on, please make it back. I'm gonna try to. Guess who? Dale Holt. I was expecting your brother. Yeah, because that would be a better Christmas. conversation. Vince. Didn't think I'd see you again so soon. Oh, uh... well, that's reassuring. Mm. You know, you were small time yeah. before today. That ugly assault a couple summers back. <laughs> so petty theft. Oh, Why? We're gonna you. have a conversation. Why do you have sure to prick him like this? And make him more annoyed and unstable. I'll do you one better, jackass. I pissed in your lemonade. Anyway... I believe you have something of mine. You really want the book, My black huh? book. Where is it? The fuck are you talking Tyler about? probably has it. Don't play games with me! Step closer and I blow his fucking head off, I swear. Tell me where Oh, it he's is. angry about I told it. You huh? already. I don't know anything about that. He's probably saying the truth. Tyler's probably the only one who knows about Look it. Your way. Sniper. Yeah, warn him. He's not gonna his, get his brain out right now. Sniper! Damn it! Take him out! Oh shit! I don't know why I saved him. I just don't think it's a good idea for him to die right now. We're going back inside. Go! Go! <laughs> Holy fucking shit! <laughs> <laughs> I saved you, kid. Jesus what do you Christ. think about that? He's got a sniper on the fucking water tower. Yeah, get away from the door. Chopper, are we? You're not kidding. He wouldn't give you a door. Achievement dodge the bullet. Nice. <laughs> it's okay. Uh. All right. <laughs> what the hell was that, Vince? I don't know. I didn't want anybody to die like right next to me. So that could be like bad for my kid and everything. Wait, is Dante not the one who sends these messages? I'm so confused about this pager, honestly. I'm misunderstanding something. Find out a book where people will die. Holy fuck! You're threatening everybody? For that book? Yeah, this is bad. He's a bad guy. What are you thinking, Tyler? I need to get on this guy's good side, huh? Guess we end up working together. Well, that's a plot twist that he did, didn't see coming. And I guess this chapter's over probably here. I'm excited to see some of these choices. There was a lot of different stuff here. <sighs> Achievement caught in a trap. Value safety. Tries to prevent harm and protect others. Yep. Yeah. Trade guided by strong moral convictions. Fast reflexes completes quick actions with speed and accuracy. Let's go. Okay, let's take a look here at all of this interesting stuff. Okay, so 
We have Vince two days earlier. Uh, what do I want to look at first? Okay, let's look at two days earlier first. Dream packing up. Finish packing up 60%. Michelle impressed 60%. I mean, that makes sense. Reassured Zoe 44%. Uh, kissed Michelle 41%. Makes sense with everything that's went on here. Let Michelle finish call 73. Believed Michelle 47. You know what? That's kind of almost more than I thought. With all that led up to this, I would expect people to be more, um, or like not believe her because it was just weird. It's a lot of choices that go from there. All right, now the big one. So what happened here? Tyler held the gun, 38%. So that started off from last time. Tricked holds to reach office, 87. Tied up in office, 72. Worked together to get free. Called Dante. Escaped office. Uh, warned Jay about cops, 58. Kind of less than I thought, actually. Cops invaded, Cho chose not to run, 55, makes sense. I feel like something bad would happen if you, you know, you got this whole area here if you do run. But you can also go back up there, which is interesting. Jim knocked out, 49. Yeah, he did panic. Jim or Zoe, for ooh, that's 50, now that surprises me. Maybe there's more people who missed the tumor thing. If that's what he wanted to talk about last time. And they chose uh, him because they thought it would die. Exchanged Jim? 19? Wait, what? Huh. I, I don't understand there, huh? Didn't forgive him 3%. Another 3%er, huh? Sorry, he, he's gotta work harder for me to forgive him. He's, he's still alive, he's still got time, he's old, he could die any time, I know, but he still has time. But he can't just like manipulate me into having empathy towards him, that doesn't, that's not how it works for me. Didn't get any pizza. <laughs> yeah, I played that one wrong, I wanted pizza. Human shield, Warren Dale about sniper, ooh. So if I didn't, he probably died, maybe? Or he would just be mad, because he would also notice, I don't know. Back safe with Dale, 56. Vince, Michelle, and Zoe remain. So they're... Hmm, interesting. I wonder what the other choices are there. Then you know what? I'm loving this. This is so cool. This game is so much fun. From the way I felt about this game like 10 minutes into the first episode, I did not think I would be so far away from that feeling now. Because I'm really invested in all of these and I'm getting really angry at some choices. And I'm getting really interested in that there's intricacy here. It seems like there's, you know, now they're putting in like Dante is a bad guy maybe. And then the boys might not be as bad as we think they are. Tyler's definitely on some kind of information that we haven't gotten yet we don't know what he's doing or thinking and you know we have jay which i think <laughs> now that i'm thinking about it we told dante about jay and i think jay uh, dante is now using jay which might be a bad thing if dante is a bad guy he might convince jay that to do something that's not really good for any of us in the end man i hmm <clears throat> I can't predict what's happening or what's going to happen. We can all just wait and see until the next episode. So if you like this one, you can always like, comment, and subscribe if you feel like it. And I will catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.